Thank you, Chris. Before I turn it over to the fighters, I would like to echo what Chris said. Uh, I've spent the last day and a half here in Reno, and people find out you're from out of town. I'm from Chicago, and I've never been to Reno before. And I must say, this is a beautiful city. I've heard a lot about this match up here where Joey and Jesse have wanted to fight for a long time. When I checked into the hotel, the woman asked me what I was doing here, you know, just casually, I was here in business, and I said, well, I'm here to do the public, uh, publicity for uh, the Brinkley versus Gilbert fight on September 14th. And she goes, oh. I said, did you have a favorite? February 14th. February 14th. I said, St. Valentine's Day, February 14th. Uh, and I asked her if she had a favorite, and she said, Jesse's going to win, absolutely. I got in a cab about an hour later, and the cabbie made some casual uh, conversation with me. And I asked, he, he asked me what I was doing here, and I explained to him I'm doing the Brinkley Gilbert fight here on February 14th. <laughs> and he goes, Oh, I know those guys. Gilbert's going to annihilate him. I said, Oh, thank you very much for your opinion. We went out to dinner last night, started making casual conversation with, with the waiter. What are you doing here? What brings you to, what brings you to Reno? I'm here to do the publicity for Civil War, February 14th, at the Reno Penn Center, Brinkley versus Gilbert. Oh, Brinkley's going to win. Absolutely. No question about it. Later on that night, I had a drink at the casino. The, wait the waitress says to me, what brings you here? I'm out of town. Obviously, I'm from out of town. I guess they have it written on my forehead. And I said, well, I'm doing the publicity for Brinkley Gilbert, the Civil War, Saturday, February 14th, at the Reno Penn Center. She goes, Joey's going to win. Joey's absolutely fantastic. He's going to win. And this is what really brings out a great fight is that the fans have a passion for this fight, and the fans are equally divided. And that's what makes it a great boxing match. These two competitors are world-class professional athletes, and world-class professional boxers. You can check the rankings, you can go online, you can see who's in the top 10 or top 15, and you'll see them mentioned in there. But the truth is, here in Reno, this is a terrific fight, because the fans are interested in this fight. We have one fighter from Urington, one fighter from Reno. They both grew up here. One went to high school in Yarrington, I believe that was Yarrington High School, is that what it's called? One went to Bishop and El Catholic. This is what makes a great fight. This is like two high school football teams that play every year. It's a big rivalry. The capacity here on Saturday, February 14th, we approximately 7,200 people. We're expecting a sold out crowd. And we're expecting to be divided 50 50. Half for Brinkley, half for Gilbert. Including the waitress and the cab driver and the person who took me into the hotel. Those people, like you, are interested in this fight, and that's why we're here. That's why the media is here, and that's why they're interested. So, thank you very much for coming. It's going to be an excellent, excellent fight. And we will announce the full undercard shortly. Press releases will go out. Again, like I said, the week of the fight, we'll have a very active participation here in the community. At this time, I'd like to bring up... At this time, I'd like to bring up... From Reno, Nevada, Joey Gilbert. Thank you, Bernie. First of all, I just want to say thank you to everyone for showing up today. Um, I couldn't have done what I've done this year and been where, been where I've been and got where I've gotten without the support of just an amazing family and incredible support group in this community. And I want to thank everybody first and foremost for coming out. I'm delighted to see everybody here. I want to give a shout out to the, to the Corona boys all here in full effect. I appreciate you guys coming out and supporting us the way you have from my amateur career all the way through my pro career. So thank you guys. Um, next, I just want to say, everyone knows I'm, I'm never really a loss for words, but I'm just going to make it you know, short and sweet. This fight has been a long time in the making. Uh, Jesse and I obviously have mixed feelings about each other. Uh, it'll be settled February 14th here in Reno at the event center. And this is a community event. It is, it is absolutely a major event. Anybody in this town, anybody in the surrounding areas is going to want to be a part of it. Uh, we've done this for a reason. We brought on the best. Uh, Terry Lane, obviously Chuck Kerner, they've really gotten together and made this thing work. And we're just exce really excited to involve the community. We really want, to be, want everyone to participate. And we want to give Reno a, a great fight. You know, and I believe it's going to be that. You know, I know I'm coming. I'm you know, going to be training as hard as I can. I'm coming to win. That's it. I know Jesse's coming to do the same thing. And, um, Expect nothing less uh, than an absolute brawl. Um, neither one of us want to lose. Neither one of us plan on losing. And uh, we're going to gut it out. So we look forward to February 14th and this community to be behind us. Uh, please, you know, I hope the waitress and the cab driver uh, come and bring me, you know, bought tickets. But uh, we don't mind the, the, the bartender and the uh, person that checked Jesse in either. Or, or either. So at any rate, 
looking forward to the fourth team and uh, hope to see you here. Thank you. Thanks very much, Joey. For the immediate here in attendance before I bring up Jesse, both fighters and their camps will be available for one-on-ones and interviews uh, to help you guys out after we're done. Um, obviously, the other guy in the fight is Jesse Brinkley. Again, on Saturday, February 14th, Yuri to Nevada's Jesse Brinkley. Thank you, everybody. Um, this fight, to me, means everything. I've trained my whole life for one night in Reno. This is it. So coming out February 14th against Joey Gilbert, someone who I really don't even care for. It's everything I've always dreamed of. And they're gonna pay me to beat him up. So to me that's like a blessing. And um, I'm not gonna underestimate him. I know he's coming to give it his all. I know he's a hell of a fighter. He does everything he needs to do to win. But his great training is over. I'll be sure to uh, show everybody February 14th that he's not the man here. I am. It's not gonna be him. I want to chase down a World Championship right after this. Be the first one here to do it. So my dreams are high. I've uh, set my goals way up and uh, I'm looking forward to it. And thanks to everybody coming out, everybody following everything that we've done in the last three, four years. It's made it easy for this fight to sell, easy for us to show everybody that we both fight. Uh, our promoters, our matchmakers, everybody's got us to where we needed to be to win these fights that we've been in. And they haven't been easy. I've, I've been in with guys that are bigger, faster, harder. I'm sure Gilbert has too. I haven't watched his fights. But um, come February 14th, I'm going to give them out for everybody here, my family, myself. And I'm looking forward to bigger things after this. But i got one guy that really wants to crush everything that I've worked for my whole life. And I refuse to let that happen. So with that, thank you.